Guys, I've done it. I have finally done it. Uh, no, I actually haven't done it. So I don't even know why I'm saying I've done it. But I am super close to doing it. What am I talking about? You may be asking. Well, I'm glad you're asking. Because yesterday, I spent a lot of time doing something. And uh, it exhausted the ever-living daylights out of me. But have a look at my player ranks here. That's right. We're just about done. I went on an absolute slaying spree yesterday with uh, my, my spear. Just me, my spear, and this cloth set of armor, and these metallic boots that keep me alive. Uh, you know, this set that lets me basically uh, see through water and roam around at the bottom of the ocean. It's crazy. It's amazing. And I can't believe it took me this long to find it or uh, we'll work it out exactly. But have a look at this. Um, yeah, three kills. I need to kill three elemental dinosaurs by hand, not riding a dinosaur. And we will receive a 60% damage reduction. How insane is that? Oh, by the way, I got this complete system wrong. I was killing beta dinosaurs only for some dumb reason. And then I was uh, quickly... Uh, corrected yesterday um <laughs> right at the start of that spree it's probably why i ended up getting it done so quickly that basically i just need to kill anything from these groups this is just the beta tier of damage reduction and alpha doesn't mean i need to kill alphas alpha means i need to kill omegas and prime means i need to kill beacon bosses and ultimate means i need to kill titans it it gets mad it gets nuts it gets crazy uh but long story short we got a long way to go for the other stuff but we are about to and today going to receive ourselves a a 60 damage reduction ah what a what a what a time also it looks like there is a b a, a at least there's a crystal wyvern thing mini boss whatever you want to call it damn there's a few bosses out there today by the looks of it a frenzy motor a man i wonder if i could actually fight one of those things I might need to go exploring. But anyways, guys, welcome back to our Omega series. I've got a lot to share with you. Uh, from all of that killing yesterday, we ended up pulling an amazing amount of loot. Um, and in, including, or included in that loot was a bunch of uh, custom items or unique items, I guess you could call them. We got some extra saddle stuff, including this, which actually might be handy. This here is a Triceratops Affinity Medallion. Ridden Dino gains the following bonus. Oh, wait, no, we found this one together. It's the Piranha one that I found on my own. It's like the first dinosaur I've actually got that we can equip something on too. Gives it uh, better ability damage and melee damage, which I think is pretty sweet, especially because it's a 19% buff. Um, and on top of that, I also found, I think some of these are new as well. We got a shoulder cannon saddle for a compi. No, we had that one already. The powder keg. This one is for a Kairuku. Um, and it's a ramshackle, which is pretty sweet. Apparently it just makes it blow everything to pieces. Um, so that's pretty cool. Also damage taken reduced. I think that's a pretty trashy uh, buff, but it is what it is. Uh, is it this one though that has the special thing? Look at this. I found, and it's very early in the search, an Ascendant Destiny Spear. That's right. We've obviously got our amazing Ethereal Spear already, which is pretty darn good. This here is the unique version of it. The crazy thing is, though, this one over here deals more damage from your throwing ability. The Destiny... I need to show you guys what this thing here can do. It's all about melee damage. I thought this dealt... Like, I was, I was confused as to why it wasn't really working as i expected and getting like crazy damage buffs when i was throwing it at things um yeah it just turns out that you need to poke things with it to deal crazy damage and when i say crazy damage i'm talking like sometimes i get like a hundred thousand damage out of this thing uh because the little buffs there are actually stackable it's nuts it's crazy um i could technically maybe one shot this but it, that'll probably kill me that might be a bad idea all right let me go and poke something else instead <laughs> let's see what sort of damage we can deal with it Look at this. 38,000 damage. Um, it's very random. 443,000 <laughs> Okay, that might actually... Oh, and then 9,000 damage. What a difference, eh? Um, yeah, as you can see, it's crazy. It's nuts. Uh, unfortunately, though, when you throw it, it just doesn't hit as, as, as hard. 1,000 damage on a fish over there. 6,000. And the reason this is actually landing is because it still has the area of effect buff because we've got the cool armor on. I'm just a little nervous about these itchy thornuses. I don't like them and I want them to die and I'm trying to just kind of hit them. Uh, 113 boss essence. That is probably the craziest chest I've ever seen. But we do need to fight some more bosses. And I'm thinking of doing that today. I'm thinking of doing that right now as a matter of fact. Um, I, oh, actually, my dude here needs some heals. All right, I'll heal you shortly. Right now though, let's go get that damage reduction. Like I said, all I need to do is find three elemental dinosaurs to throw a spear at. And uh, we're done skis for that once and for all. 
However, it seems as though I'm not finding ma ma many elemental dinosaurs right this second. What is going on? Where are they all hiding? Hold on, there's one down here. Earthstorm. Um, all right. I'd rather something a little easier to kill. That's a minion. Um, all right. Wow. Uh, a lot of fish down here, but they're all just basic fish. Wow. Okay. I thought I'd be able to find this really easily. The shark, 100%. Lightning storm. Yes. No, that's, that is, that is, that is elemental. All right. Sweet as. All right. Um, I think for this one though, we're just going to switch to our original, our original spear. But basically, yeah, both spears kind of have purpose. Wow, that's volatile. That'll blow me up, right? But I can still kill it. I shouldn't have done that. What was I doing? I thought volatile. I was thinking of detonate. What a dummy. <laughs> detonate dinosaurs are the ones that uh, when they hit you, they buff you with like a thing that makes you explode. I got mixed up. My bad. Okay, that was really, that was kind of stupid. Uh, very stupid, as a matter of fact. But it gives me an opportunity to demonstrate something I've got in here. The dimensional network. We haven't used this yet in an episode. We, we worked this out on the stream. This is a part of the mod um, that lets us teleport around the map, basically. Uh, but what it also lets me do is teleport dinosaurs to me. So I can teleport my Pteranodon back to me. And uh, we, can, we can head back down and make the same mistake all over again. How cool is that? Um, I really got to heal you though, so please don't go dying anytime soon. But more importantly, I need to hit this shark. Don't even need to hit it. Just got to get near it. There we go. Just a few times. There we go. That's one down. Uh, wow, that shark died as well. I don't want to... Wait, am I swimming? Oh, I'm swimming. Oh, I don't mind this. I can actually see what I'm doing at least. That's kind of nice. Um, I just... Man, there's like nothing out here today. And I can't throw my spear. I gotta re-equip my well, unequipped and then re-equip my armor. I think that's the problem. Um, but my goodness, just let me find some some easy elemental dinosaurs. Oh great. <laughs> that's not what I had hoped for. Okay, I'm starting to wonder if there actually are any elemental dinosaurs out here, because currently I'm not seeing none. I do see you over there though. Beta soul. Hello, friend. That has to be. Beta ice. Okay, nice. Let's go. Wait, why are these guys still attacking me? Oh, no. I don't even know what we're looking at right here. Oh, good. Good thing. Summoning little minions, the bugger. All right, these guys are still angry because I attacked a thing. Oh, I'm going to die. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah, get wrecked, minions. Get wrecked. You too, little dolphin. I'm so sorry about this, but it just needs to happen. All right. Surely that leaves us with one left remaining. Oh my goodness. I swear I did this so much quicker, but I wasn't recording and I have no idea why this is, uh, why we're having so much trouble finding just a regular, just a casual elemental dinosaur. But here we are, I guess. Here we are. Oh yeah. And like I said, the loot. Have a look at it. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Somebody shooting little ice balls at me. Can't quite see who it is, but there's someone down there doing it. If I can hit it, then we'll be good. Fireballs. Okay, that's an elemental. That's an elemental. There we go. We've ranked up at last. Nice. I say there's still someone else over there doing things. Quick little quest scroll grab. And we're done. We've reached it. We've done it. Nice. Also, really quickly, because you're dead, I may as well go and grab the loot from your buddy. Oh, nice. Okay, so now when things attack me, they're going to deal 60% less damage. Um, and yeah, all I can really do then to get even better at this is um, kill a lot of Omega Dinosaurs by hand. And that, that's a little bit more of a task, but it's it's not impossible. In fact, it's really easily with these spears. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll, I'll work on that. I'll work on that in my own time. <laughs> that's going to be a very time-consuming process. Okay, so uh, I was just uh, I was just dumping everything in here. Uh, the quest scroll that we found ended up being a 1,000 wild dino kills, and we get a megalodon paragon. So that's okay. Um, but have a look at all the quests that we now have. By the way, <laughs> we got lots of quests to work on, and a lot of them are really time-consuming ones. Um, the this one here is actually cool. I worked a lot through this yesterday, uh, just unintentionally, just because we were doing it anyways. We ended up killing about well 1,500 total, and a lot of that was yesterday. 
um yeah as you can see we're, we're slowly working through these and uh getting we're gonna get a lot of paragon souls soon and max experience potions too hopefully um but yeah the more the merrier why not just give me all the quests you possibly can anyways i think it's time we go and fight another boss i don't yet know who i'm going to bring with me into this fight um nor how i'm going to tackle this fight in fact it's probably a good idea that we go and return our soul scream armor over here um which by the way i forgot to show you this completely forgot to show you this uh think of these boots these are soul screen boots uh custom drop as you can tell um but they have pretty good stats on them journeyman fantastic hey i love it it's really cool um we're not really going to use those right this second though but i was wondering if there was a set here that could help us out and i think there is one i think the defender uh if we wanted to do this like butt naked type of thing this here, again, I guess stacks with the 60% damage reduction and can reduce our damage even further. Uh, as you can see, 50% damage reduction just from the chest piece. Immune to collective and bleed damage. 10% um, chance to stun enemies when they're hit. And then we got leggings. I don't know what the leggings do. But with four pieces of this set, we end up being able to reflect. Reflect. So our shield reflects 90% of damage to the attacker. So if we were to be able to complete this set, you gain the full defender buff whatever that means i feel like we would be almost i don't know not untouchable but we'd be able to run in the, around in the wild pretty confidently and and i assume like not die very easily so that thing would be cool if i wanted to fight a boss by hand which eventually we are going to need to we also got the olympian set which is all to do with our little torch down there we've got the piper set which is good for getaway minions which i can't imagine me using uh this set the gifted set is for some custom weapon or unique weapon that i don't yet have in fact a lot of them are all about making unique weapons and certain weapons work even better the boomstick for example have a look at this one we'll be able to if we were in water which we, we actually tested this set out on the stream and i ended up killing a super super rare unique dinosaur it sucked it was the trilobite its name is spirit it was down here i just swam too close to it and it died it would have been apparently it's one of the strongest teams in the game so that was really really upsetting anyways let's just go and do this thing i want to test ourselves out against something a little different i should we should level this guy up this guy here would be an absolute beast in a fight um but i got a little bit of work to do before then i suppose um what am i here to do i'm here to grab some souls so um we can choose what we want to fight or i can use one of these instead i'm honestly thinking of like a spiritual it just means it's going to be fast a cloner that's gonna clone me though um i want to fight like an alpha or a prime i feel like we could do it i don't know if we actually can but we may as well try maybe an alpha colossus that's the let me just have a quick little peek in here though mythical colossus um damage 300 okay so it does deal some pretty big damage bombs addition oh and it has high health damage weight and torpor yeah it's not the end of the world let's just have a look at what alpha souls i actually have in here i reckon spiritual might be the way to go or if i want to fight a beta boss maybe a siren it's just gonna like freeze me every now and then i think firestorm i'm not really concerned about any of these let's just bring a bunch of them and we'll just see what happens the question is though who we're gonna bring into this fight i'm very tempted to bring my spino because he's an absolute butt kicker we could also bring one of my therizinosaurs they are very low on health though um my tyrannodon he's pretty cool as well or before i do leave i think it makes sense to bring some health potions i've been meaning to pick these up for such a long time and i just keep forgetting we are 100 going to bring them with us we can bring a rampage potion i don't think we're gonna need them though El elemental resistance yo that would be handy maybe but i think our biggest our biggest struggle is going to be actually dealing damage to this thing so let's go i'm almost tempted to bring my psychosis to run it on as well i just what sort of damage does this guy deal hold on 70 000. like it's up there with it's up there with our spino and if i use my c ability it'll be even better i don't have any armor on uh oh i gotta get my armor on oh yeah 100 i gotta do that um or do i use my pteranodon doesn't have a good saddle though is the only thing yeah i forgot my spino has got a really good saddle so i think i'm gonna have to use that this guy here is just a little bit a little bit weak in that regard so you come in here um there was nothing on your body you're you're not full health all right let me let me give you some little basic ones all right there's a bit of a cool down there and then i guess like how 
Wait, am I gonna die? Okay, that's the siren ability. Wait, is that a reap? <gasps> uh, wait. Oh gosh. No, no, no. My damage reduction. It's not saving me. <laughs> oh, it's a minion. Siren, Skilly, Zul, Dodo, Reaper. Are you kidding me? Okay then. All right, buddy, 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 buddy. Get out of here, will ya? Oh my goodness. Okay. That was a little bit hectic for no reason whatsoever, but thanks for, thanks for, I don't know, showing up and saying hello, I guess. Uh, wowzers. Okay, okay, okay. Well, what's the worst that could possibly come out of this thing then? Hey, let's do, oh, Windstorm is just annoying. Let's just do a siren. I think it's a siren. So if I put that there, sacrifice the souls to lure in enemies that can be either killed or tamed. All summoned enemies will be hostile. More souls increase the chance of a higher tier. 100 souls will summon a boss. Uh, summoning a boss would... Wait, what? Do I still need the 100 souls? I thought just putting this here handles that. Maybe I was wrong. I guess I still need the 100 souls. All right, well, in that case... All right, let's, um, let's head back to base really quickly. At least while I'm there, I can grab my armor. And then I guess I'll grab a stack of souls while I'm here. Which, by the way, isn't much of an issue because I have a lot of souls now. Especially mythical souls, which are the ones that we actually kind of need. So, cool. We got those. I assume my armor is in here with a lot of the other custom pieces of pieces that I got yesterday. Like I said, we got a lot of loot yesterday. <laughs> it's actually kind of crazy, including like this. Elemental damage reduced by 14%. That actually sounds pretty good. Um, but what I was coming here to get was just my, my flax set. Is there actually anything? I got to sort through these. There's that many here now that... Yeah, like armor bonus when equipped, fortitude increased, explosion damage taken, damage take oh, reduced by 78. That's that's pretty average. Oh, hello. Magic find increased by 6%. Dude, this is amazing. Even if it's just for the magic find, that 6% uh, chance that more better, like custom weapons and unique stuff is going to drop. Plus armor bonus, chance to dodge, swim speed, oxygen. All right, half of that's pretty average, but I'm still going to equip it. Um, It's much better than this. Yeah, let's, let's, let's go with that one there, I think. Also, what are these? Elemental damage taken reduced by 10%. Dude, that's amazing. I don't know if it flows onto our teams, but there's some pretty good stuff here. All right, let's equip my stuff. Is that a full set? I need some hands. Oh, that's these ones. XP gained. Elemental damage taken reduced. Yeah, I've got no idea if this flows onto teams or not. But since we're fighting elemental dinosaurs... No, we're not. We're fighting a siren dinosaur. Well, maybe I will fight some elemental dinosaurs. We're going to test this thing out right this second. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm like just confusing the ever-living daylights out of myself right here. All right, let's go and do this thing. Okay. So, are we going to do... All right, let me... First things first. I just wanted to see if they, they work together. They don't. Mythical. How do I get this to work? What am I doing wrong here? Is it because I placed this down before I before the tribe was made yeah i think it might have been the problem now it's green i wonder if that changes things up a little bit yeah it does okay so it was purely just because the whole base claiming situation um it's all sorted now it's all good uh so i can just summon an alpha boss we didn't even need all of this stuff here so let's do it this is gonna be such a mistake isn't it this is gonna be such a mistake i'm actually so nervous about this i don't know what's gonna come out the other side of this i haven't even fought a beta boss yet um but it's a gorilla with 100 million health um i'm in trouble oh gosh it just dealt two and a half million damage to me oh oh no oh no no nope, this thing's too strong i'm not ready for alpha bosses yet um i'm not even healing wait what i'm dead i'm dead oh my oh oh my goodness <laughs> Um, okay, I overestimated my strength. Um, okay. I, wh where? Oh no, he's gonna follow me to base as well. Is that why I'm meant to do this further away from home? Um, hi, how you, <laughs> how you doing down there, mate? I'm not going anywhere near that thing. Oh dear, what have I done? Okay, I should have known. I should have known. 
Well, some time has passed and our buddy is still just chilling at the bottom of the river. He's pretty stuck down there, but I don't, I don't, it's not safe. It's not safe anywhere anymore. So I don't really know what to do about that. Uh, he's down there. That's all there is to it. But I've been trying to put my mind towards what we can do to counter this because clearly, uh, we, we got some, we got some thinking to do. Um, I don't think I'm going to be able to kill that for a little while yet, but it, has i guess opened my eyes to we need some more potential boss killers also what is with my low res armor right now there we go sorted itself out eventually um and yeah i've been looking at like what we can do from here and from what i understand the best bet is essentially getting stronger dinosaurs stronger saddles which uh we have you know custom saddle uh, unique saddles and stuff like that in here so but from what has been described to me we need to i guess match unique saddles to strong dinosaurs with strong armor and strong imbues on those saddles and eventually just like yeah kind of kicks them but uh the other thing is in here paragon souls so paragon souls are going to play a big part as well so we basically need to target dinosaurs that we have paragon souls for that are strong and we have unique saddles for and right now we kind of do have an option in that regard it's a piranha of all things um i think we've only got one piranha paragon soul unfortunately but still just having one is kind of uncommon um or the trilobite i think trilobite's also kind of we're getting there if only i had that spirit trilobite it would have been amazing um in case you're wondering what a spirit trilobite actually looks like it's a good question because i actually have never looked it up it's in here though uh it's this guy the unique spirit it has supernova which is a crazy ability and stalker i don't know what stalker does um uh, it deals it's 24 like that's a that's a massive multiplier of damage and health um and then yeah of course you've got the saddle for it as well which gives it 75 percent damage reduction 300 percent movement speed um you lose one percent health per second above 50 percent oh that's a bit of a i don't like that attackers bleed based on damage dealt bleed increases as the trilobite's health decreases interesting so it's 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 intense it's crazy um but the beautiful thing about it is i do have it in here so i think i do need to find myself a strong trilobite um or we just gotta find ourselves a spirit i think spirit is the answer to that one there that's one of the options anyways uh but in the meantime what i have been doing is just sorting through all of our random loot that i've found and working out what i'm gonna grind up what i'm gonna keep what's worth keeping what's not a lot of it isn't it's all pretty pretty trash to be honest <laughs> except for this one i don't know what indestructible means and that actually sounds kind of cool uh, as a as an imbue thing about bobby i don't really know where to find out about it either i assume it's in here somewhere i don't know where you would look for it wasn't sure if there's like an indestructible buff or maybe it just can't be broken maybe i can't be broken i don't know either ways i'm not gonna break these boots just in case there is something like special about them i think we should hold on to them just in case um but anyways all of this ground up um so yeah and these three here i'm gonna hold on to just for the sake of holding on to them really so uh yeah maybe for now we should just leave home for a little bit unless hold on a second did he despawn where did our big gorilla friend go he's no longer down here hold on if he's despawned i can actually i can i can i can live i can survive again he may have despawned hold on i need to have a little bit of a search around and see if i can find his big old gorilla butt uh we might be free i might no longer be trapped inside of my base and that would be lovely uh guys i don't think he exists anymore which means i'm gonna go back to the original plan and i'm gonna go and find something in fact i could fight a saddle boss no, we're not going to do that. Let's just grab some of these and we're going to fight a random elemental. Who are we going to fight it with? I no longer have a Spino. In fact, this is probably a terrible idea. Um, but we do have a Dimorphodon, a really strong Dimorphodon at that. Um, or I could bring out one of my Therizinosaurs, but they're kind of a bit butchered as well. Uh, there's probably no... Yeah, I still need a really good strong dinosaur. I'm hoping that this frenzy piranha over here helps us out one day. I really hope that you're a good piranha, buddy. Um, but for now let me see Ooh, what am i gonna do what am i gonna do who, who are we gonna bring out to this one here i can i can drop gamma rays on its butt or i can uh, just rip out the pteranodon but i would hate to lose it should we just summon in a boss and see what happens i don't even have a good saddle though 
Ah, this is so touchy. This is so tricky. I don't really know what to do. No, we're not going to fight another boss. I feel like it would be a really dumb thing to do. What we are going to do soon though, or maybe even now, is turn our attention to trying to get a nice uh, magic find set of armor. And I'm going to show you exactly what I'm talking about right now. Um, we obviously pulled this which gives us 6% magic finds. Basically, we want to maximize our chances of getting good drops from killing things. And the best way to do that is by finding somehow a set of armor that's going to allow us to do exactly that. And to do that, we're going to hop inside the imbue bench. I'm going to dump all of this really good armor that I've been finding. And we are going to basically put essence in here. Uh, you, you guys kind of know the drill by now. The thing is, I don't want to waste Omega because... Have a look at this. Let's say... If I use ultimate, it's going to be pretty expensive. We're only going to be able to do like five pieces. If I do prime, we can do a lot more. I got a lot of prime essence. So I'm going to just try to do a few prime imbues just to see if we can get a nice piece here. Um, and we'll see what happens. Yeah, let's roll it. Maybe I'll start with these ones. No, they've already, they're already good. I could re-roll those though. I'm going to re-roll those. Let's start with that one there. Because, because we just ground up a bunch of stuff. Nope, not you. In here. We got all of this stuff. Not you. You can go back. So we can get actual a free reroll on these pants. Unless I want to do it on these ones instead. Reactive damage, armor bonus, stamina, health. Yeah, that's all looking okay. These ones here I was never a big fan of. Except for elemental damage taken reduced by 30%. That's actually really good. <laughs> Unless there's a good reroll I can roll on one of these. This helmet looks pretty average. I'm going to reroll this helmet. Let's go. Three, two, one. Reroll. And we got what? Armor bonus. Elemental damage reduced by 21%. Dude, we have crazy elemental damage reduction. Uh, better weight. Health regeneration. Uh, it's not great, but it's it's not terrible either. Decent, but not fantastic. All right, let's get back to the original plan and do some prime imbues. Starting with some hazard pants. Go. Elemental damage. More elemental damage. Man, this game just doesn't want me to take elemental damage. Let's go again. Boom. Uh, that's a terrible. That's a terrible. I can re-roll it, but that is terrible. Um, except melee damage increased by 31%. That just sounds okay. Um, but only two two things. So let's try on these ones. Bam. Okay, four again, but no magic find. Um, maximum durability. Yeah, whatever. Let's go on these ones. We got three. We got that indestructible buff again, but I still don't know what that means. All right, let's try on the gloves. No magic find yet again. Uh, the helmet? No, man, man, it is hard to get this. My goodness. Uh, we're running out of options here. Bam. Magic find! Increased by 25%! Yo! <laughs> that is amazing! Okay, okay, that is a jackpot. Um, let me just double check and make sure that we haven't got that on anything else. Because I'm pretty sure we haven't. Uh, all right, let's do these gloves. No magic find on those either. I'm going to have a proper look through all of this in my own time. Bam. No magic find. No magic find. Uh, nope. Gas mask. Nope. Leggings have already done. Hat. Nah. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, what's this one? Dude, this one's got five different imbues on it. This is an amazing... Um Dude, this is an insane ride helmet. But it has nothing good about it. All right, journeyman mask. Nope. And last but not least, all stats increased. Damage taken reduced by 99. Movement speed. Oxygen. So that's the only piece that I could get. But that's not too bad. Combines with this which gives us six percent plus 25 that's 31 percent increase uh magic fine chance that's a lot that is a lot and on top of that i could also re-roll some of this stuff too uh what's one that i might actually use i mean these gloves are pretty good but they've only got three pieces of them all right let's try it unfortunately no luck there you can re-roll you can re-roll charms. Not that I really want to because that's a pretty good charm. But that's what charm fragments are for. I didn't even know you could do that. And I went and butchered them all. So I can't even do anything with them anyways. Oh, dang. That was stupid. Oh, well, not the end of the world. Okay. Well, look. Now I just want to go out and see what we can actually achieve with this extra 30% magic find. Um, so if I go and kill some things... I'm not really expected. Like, there is a pretty high chance now that we're going to get some cool loot. Also, really quickly, let's jump inside of here and... Fantastic. Why not? More boss souls. 
great let's go and allocate these 40 levels because i can't think of a reason not to as well i know we've only killed like five dinosaurs so far but i was hoping to get some more items out of this <laughs> you know what might actually be the best bet to do here wait i gotta be careful this gorilla might still be on the wild down here but i i, I don't think he is um oh no hold on i've now i have to be careful to do this because i need to keep my chest on oh okay this gets a little tricky now so if i want to use the soul scream set as well as this i don't know if i can well i can't that's only going to give me four and then i can't run around down there oh no i didn't even think of that uh i can still throw these around and kill a bunch of things but i can't run around under the ground with my amazing uh, magic find piece of armor. Oh, dang it. All right. Have a look at this thing. It's obviously another one of these mini bosses. We saw it earlier from like across the map, but it can only be damaged by Tapajara. It gains resistances to, da uh, to take to take in damage types, but two saddle tokens. That would be such a good kill if I could actually get a kill on it, but I don't think we're able to, unfortunately. So it is what it is. Ooh. It's a Paragon Meganura. Hello? I just can't hit the darn thing. Um, hello, Ultimate Essence Dilo. How you doing? Where did you even come from? Uh, that is a good Dilo right there. Oh my goodness. I, I don't even know where this thing appeared, but I wonder if my magic find is gonna... Nah, I won't pull anything cool out of this. But still, I'm gonna 100% stop and kill this thing. Hey, there's my Paragon Soul. And come on, give me what I'm asking for, my little dude. This thing's gonna give me so much essence. Oh, hello. <laughs> Dodo Ivan out of nowhere. And a Dodo Rex. What? Not to be confused with a Rex Dodo, of course. I legit cannot finish this thing off. I just can't hit it. I cannot hit this thing. I'm on like a 50 miss streak. That is how just insanely durable this little dude is. I don't think I've ever missed a dinosaur this many times. What in the world is happening? Even my special ability does nothing. Um, this is nuts. This is actually crazy. Uh, <laughs> okay then. Buddy, just, just let me hit you one time. That's all I gotta do. That's all I gotta do. Gotcha. There we go. 121 ultimate essence and then about 100 of the rest. Good. Oh, hello. <gasps> last we actually got some loot there we go it's um it's a piece it's a piece of things it's a piece of stuff well cool i guess hey hold on what was that i didn't even see that little feather light but yes we got more loot it's another medallion though i don't want any more medallions they're not that they're pointless to us but they're certainly not like the most valuable thing we could be finding but hey, at least we got another chest. That's pretty cool. <gasps> Yo, have a look at this Triceratops. It's an Omega knockback. I don't think it's like gonna be a boss killer by any means or anything like that. But I do have, I do have a custom thing to equip this with. This is actually potentially worth taming. Also, that's a, that's a treasure. No, that's the Lightning Mega Nero. Um, that might actually be worth trying to tame up. And I just so happen to have the means to do so on me right now. I don't have the, the kibble, of course. But what I do have on me is the set of armor that's going to let us deal an absolute truckload of top water, this thing. Um, I know it's not what we came out here to do right this second, but... Oh, no. Hold on. Hold on just a second. <laughs> a little bit of a dragonfly swarm, which... There we go. That takes care of that. Uh, and this guy here is a little bit angry with us. So I should probably be very, very careful around him. I could actually tame both of these. And we could breed like a ridiculously insane Triceratops. Like, you know, imprinted and all that fun stuff, of course, is what, is what I'm trying to say here. They are both, they are both rage dinosaurs. But I guess the big thing is I need to know what it does if we get a unique saddle for one of these charge damage doubles damage reduction while charging uh, double charge build up speed and then charge damage. so basically it just makes your charge ridiculously powerful is that something i need i don't know <gasps> water chest 
Oh, I still am not able to open these ones here. Look how much they need. But still, I really, I really want to. I really want to. You know, I'm just going to kill this guy. You're an, you're an Omega. You might give me some pretty cool loot. Oh, look at the damage it deals. I should tame you. I should tame you. Also, thanks. Thanks. I appreciate that, my dude. Wow. Yeah, I don't think I got a choice. I got to knock this guy out somehow. Psych. I'm going to kill it. <laughs> Get wrecked. Let's go. Get out of my face. I'm sick of you not letting me land. You angry thing. Yeah. All we do is get a soul for it, but... Yeah, I was hoping maybe we get some nice armor out of it. I guess it wasn't meant to be. What in the world is this? Did you see that? There was... Is that a barrage? There was a bunch of weird stuff falling from the sky. I've never seen that before. Beta barrage compi. It's an elemental. Is that actually a variant? I've never seen that before. <laughs> that actually sounds kind of weird. All right, I thought something was bugging out, but that's literally what it's meant to do. Cool. Well, I'm going to continue on this journey. I'm just going to kill a bunch of stuff, hoping to eventually get some nice drops. Still going to keep an eye out for any cool Omegas that might be able to help us uh, as we progress as well. I'm basically just going to keep my eyes peeled for anything of interest. But thank you so much for watching this failed attempt at a, an alpha boss fight. Hope you did enjoy it. I'll catch you in the next one very, very soon. Bye. That's not a wave. Bye for now.